Okay. Good morning. Uh, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Uh, today, what I'm going to do is try to explain about my demo board. Okay. So this is my demonstration board that I intend to use in my uh, series of BMS tutorials. Okay. Now, what I have here is a complete system. I, I can say it's a complete system. Okay. So because I have here a uh, motor control, I have here some uh, what you can call this uh, some something to simulate the operation of a particular equipment. I have here my automation server. As you can see here, I have my automation server here. Okay. Now I have here the I/O modules. Okay. Now I have here uh, digital out uh, DG, DO module. I have here a uh, combination of module, universal input, analog output. Then I have here an analog output module. I have here a uh, combination of UI and digital output module. And I have here a uh, universal input module. Well, universal input module you can use it also uh, in digital uh, in digital inputs. Okay, UI or digital inputs. Now, I have here some backnet controllers. I have three backnet controllers here, okay? Now, uh, these backnet controllers, uh, actually, it is already networked using MSTP, okay? Master slave token passing. As you can see, this backnet will communicate to my automation server to this uh, network. Now, I'm using here an RS485 for my MSTP network, okay? Now, I have here, this is part of my motor control. I didn't put it inside this uh, enclosure because it's too small. So, I just put it outside for better view, okay? Now, what I have here, I have three magnetic contactors. I have here uh, overload protection, which is already uh, set, okay? Now, I have here some relays that I will be using for my tutorials, especially in doing uh, control, uh, programming okay now i have here also at the top are some field devices okay now i have here temperature sensor pressure sensor differential pressure switch valve actuators now i have here two small motor fans for simulating uh, an equipment operation again i have here some damper actuators i have here a temperature and uh, Humidity sensors, I have a timer here. Now, I have here, in this part, I have a valve actuator here, okay? Now, I have a valve and a valve actuator. For a BMS engineer, you should be able to uh, wire and uh, control this valve actuator, okay? As you know, valve actuator is the one automatically opening and closing the valve as per the requirement in the side, okay? So we, sh we usually we use this for chilled water control, okay? Now I have here up down are my uh, power supplies, okay? Now uh, at the bottom, I have some equipment there, okay? So those equipment, uh, I'm using it for demonstrating uh, submersible pump controls, okay? So this is my demo board that uh, I intend to use in my series of video tutorial, okay? Now, uh, once again, thank you very much for watching these short video clips. And once again, if you are new to my YouTube channel, please subscribe and click also the notification bell so you will be notified uh, if there is a new video in my channel. Again, thank you very much. Bye for now.